Oi! Oi! Who the fuck you think you're spitting at, mate? <laughs> oh, but I'd say suck on that, but you apparently already are. Fuck, that was wicked. G'day, guys. My name's Josh. Yo, can call me Jawoodle, and welcome back finally to the world of Assassin's Creed. Welcome to Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and I am so, so goddamn excited because not only do I fucking love Assassin's Creed, I also fucking love Ancient Greece, all of like the ancient eras, like the ancient imperial eras, especially. So like the Roman Empire, ancient Greece, ancient Rome, the Ottoman Empire, all of that shit just gets my nipples all sorts of tingly. So having a game that's set in that time period is getting my juices all sorts of flowing. I am moist coming into this. I literally just got the game, getting into the very first time, and I'm going, I'm so excited to make a whole series on Assassin's Creed Odyssey. So, I mean, it looks the same as uh, Origins so far, but I, I don't care. I don't care. I'm just excited. I want to get my Spartan on. I think, I think I'm think i a Spartan. I don't know. I've tried to not watch any trailers. I saw it was coming. I knew I was going to get it. So, I tried not to, like, build up my expectations of the game too much at all. I wanted... It's like when you go see a movie, when you saw... Like, like Deadpool 2, for example, was a pretty good movie. But because Deadpool 1 was so fucking good, everyone expected so much more from Deadpool 2. And it may have just gone a little bit flat because of that. But if you have high expectations, you can get disappointed. If I come into this with no expectations, then I can't be disappointed, can I? I can only be happy. I can only enjoy it as best I can. And that so far, all I'm doing is enjoying a very long loading screen. Come on! Okay, there you go. So you start complaining about shit, and shit happens. Oh, yes, I'm pumped. I'm so pumped. Who am I? Where am I? What am I doing? What's my first mission? Is this me? I don't know. King Leonidas of Sparta, the Battle of Thermopylae, the famous Battle of the 300. I get to take part in this? Have you ever gone fishing with your son? Yes, I'm so pumped. No, never. Oh, I love the Spartans. I love the whole way of the Spartan life. If you don't know about it, go watch uh, Historia Civilis. Whatever it is. I don't know. You know, there's a YouTube channel with a whole bunch of, like, history explanations and stuff. And explained, like, the, the, the constitution of the Spartans. And it's just fucking dope. Oh, this is awesome. Let us meet our fate, shall we? Oh, this is so cool. I love that it's coming into the Battle of Thermopylae. That's such a cool battle to be a part of. Spartans, every breath that you have taken has led you to this moment. Every drop of blood, sweat, and tear, all of it has led to where you stand right now. The Persians come to make slaves of us all. I have a better idea. I say we drench the gods with their blood! What say you, Spartans? For our sons! For our daughters! For Sparta! Oh, goosebumps. Oh, tingles. Oh, oh yes, okay. I'm ready. I'm ready. Fucking come at me, you Persian dogs! Oh, yes. Let me fuck them up. Let me kick their stupid asses into giant pits of death. Oh, yeah. Oh, I've waited so long for this moment and it's not let me down so far. The first five minutes is fucking awesome. Come on, get me in there. Give me a spear. Let me control Leonidas or anyone. Give me some sort of weapon and I'll prove to these... <laughs> I'll prove these people are not the immortals they claim to be. Yes! Get fucked on! <laughs> Did he just break that dude's neck with one hand? He just lets him up and just go like that and snap his neck? That's incredible. I'm, I mean, I know the Spartans are wicked, but like, that's just, that's just insane. Come on, let me, let me take control. Let me save him. Let me save him. Oh, that's just brutal. Yes, here we go. Okay, press LB to light attack. Gotcha. Just like, just, just fuck him up. 5,400 damage. Holy shit, this thing's a weapon. Oh, yes. Okay, come on. Uh, LB and A to bull rush ability. Uh, uh, try that one. There you go. Oh my god! I went straight through the bloke and he just disappeared. What about this one? Oh, 1400 damage. Holy shit, this spear is amazing. I want to keep this spear forever. Yes, stab everyone! 
I don't know what I just did, but it was fucking awesome. Okay, I th I'm just, I'm instinctively pushing buttons and it seems to be working a little bit. Can I, so hold both? Okay, RB and LB is blocked, I gotcha. What was the, what was the bull rush thing? Oh, it doesn't really matter anymore because I just fucking fucked that Jeffrey up. Is it this one? Yes, it was. Oh, okay, I love it. I love it so far. This is everything I wanted it to be. I'm a fucking Spartan. Get the fuck out of my way. I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. So I'm just like charging into battle and stabbing as many Jeffreys in the back of the head as I possibly can. Ow, you sausage, come here. Ah, there we go. Okay, so I guess I have to kill all of like the level 40 big dudes. Is that is that the plan? I don't know. That's a cool little block maneuver though. I like that. Oh, buddy, buddy, you, you can't be doing that shit. If you're not even facing me, you're probably not gonna hit me. Oh, that, that block and like stun is so cool. Oh, <laughs> he's got my spear. Give me my spear back. You can't steal my spear. I know your spine wrapped, wrapped around it a little bit and it kind of wasn't your fault. You gotta give it back after I'm finished with you. So I assume if right bumper is like weak attack, then probably right trigger is heavy attack. Let's, fi let's find a Jeffrey and find out. Just Oh yeah, it is. Okay, he does like a big, like a big pullback. Can I do that in like a whole, a whole chain of things? Oh, that was wicked. That was really wicked. Is it over? The arrows are blotting out the sun. It's all over. The 300 of one. They did actually win a couple battles over the first couple days up on the cliffs of Thermopylae. Uh, but we all know how it ends. We've all seen 300. Not quite as the. I mean, that movie's a little bit fictionalized, but. Oh, 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 that was so quick and so casually just split a guy's face in half with a fucking sword. Oh, that was wicked. Is this one of the immortals? Is it all oh, one on one? One on one me on Rust, bro. Come at me. Yeah, nice try, buddy. Nice try. You got no chance. Look, I can just, I can X to dodge. Gotcha. And then like just attack. He's got a shield. So can I hit him heavy and to break guard? Yes, I can. Okay. The f extend, extend your dodge. I don't understand. Hold X to extend your dodge. Oh, I could like a sweep back with somersault. Oh, can't hit me. Oh, no, get closer, uh, Leonidas. You gotta hit him, you're too far away. Shit! Ah, good dodge. I've got it figured out. I have to just dodge this fool and then get around him and then hit him from the back with a heavy attack and then some light attacks. That spear's got so much reach and I love it. Come on, hit me. Hit me. Hit me, you Persian dog. There we go. Tell Cersei about your sweet one on one battle, Leonidas, where you got your fucking Persian ass kicked. You can't hit me. Oh, he hit me. He hit me. Never mind. I, I, I got way too cocky, way too quick. But I am Spartan, so I guess that's kind of how it works. Oh, yes. Paint my armor red with your own fucking blood. One more hit and he's done. I'm hitting this time. Come on. Fight me. Fight me. Good. Yep. Good. Nice attack. Oh, unlucky, buddy. How's your organs feel? Pick them up off the ground and ask them because they're kind of spotted everywhere right now. Oh, yes, Leonidas. Fuck that shit up. Oh, this is good. I'm already just out of the game and I'm already frothing it. This is this is the rest of the channel. For the next six months of the channel, it's just going to be Red Dead Redemption, Assassin's Creed, and that's, that's about it. Because who wants to play anything else? The Spartans have won the day. There's a pile of Persian bodies. They have retreated to recoup and re-attack tomorrow. Oh, there's a prisoner. This is going to end badly for you, dude. Oh, he's a Spartan? Kill him. Kill him. Oh no, that's a Persian. He's just telling us that they're, they're coming for us. I thought he was a Spartan. Because we do know they were also uh, they were um, um, betrayed by one of the Spartan soldiers. Oi, oi! Who the fuck you think you're spitting at, mate? Suck on that, but you apparently already are. Fuck, that was wicked. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally, is this the same girl from, um, I like how there's this ancient artifact apparently buried two feet under like one rock. This is big, Layla. Do you really think it's the spear? This is the one. The book was almost right on top of it. Who hid that thing? It wasn't hidden at all. Lucky in my life. Okay. But anyway, yeah. So this is the. This looks like the same girl from uh from Origins who was uh controlling Bayek and Aya. 
So Manimus too. Oh, interesting. I can either I, I can play on the old mode with like, you know, like GPS locators and stuff like that. The way that the traditional Assassin's Creed games worked. Or exploration mode, which is the way Assassin's Creed Odyssey is meant to be experienced. Well, if that's the way it's meant to be experienced, then I'm going, going to do it the way you intend it to be done. Anyone. I've also chosen to play on hard, not nightmare. There's a heart, there's a nightmare mode, so that sounds like a whole lot of butt fuckery right there. I'm playing on hard. I like a challenge, I like having control over my character's elements. But I don't want to get fucked. Uh, 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 too hard. I just want to have a nice experience, but also a little bit of a challenge. I just hope you listen to what this says as well. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're going to have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. Oh, that's interesting. That's a cool way to bring in the the idea of having like choosing your character. Select a hero. Could it be Alexios or Cassandra? Oh, I don't. I don't know. I don't know. Both of these look kind of cool. I've, I mean, well, I've always played as male assassins, like the whole way through. And leading into this, I played through Assassin's Creed 1, 2, or well, the 2 trilogy, and 3 as well. So I'm like, I've, I've been playing a lot of assassin dudes. I feel like it's time we play as an assassin heroine as opposed to a hero. But I mean, that is the, the, two, the, the two gender terms for this, isn't it? Hold A to select a hero. I'm going to be Cassandra. White's green fading in, ready to pop me down into ancient Greece somewhere two, two and a half thousand years ago, wherever it was. But wait, BC and BCE. When does BC cross into BCE? Or are they the same thing? I don't actually know. This is in BCE. 531 BCE, I think they said. So like, uh, 431, I was close. BCE. Is BCE the same as BC? I don't know. I should have really learned like the historical dates. That's that looks wicked. Oh, this game is gorgeous already. Fuck, that looks cool. So do I have? I mean, I had my 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 hawk in the was a hawk or an eagle? I think it was probably an eagle, judging by the way Assassin's Creed works. I had my eagle in the last the last game. Do I have an eagle friend in this one as well? I don't know. I guess we'll find out. Where the hell did that fish come from? He just picked up the fish and dropped it. He just went, he murdered that fish just for the thrill of it. You're, an, you're a dickbag of an eagle. God, it looks cool though. Oh, it's so gorgeous. I'm so pumped to get into control of this shit. Oh, here we go. Here's Cassandra with, with, with the little spear of destiny that we uncovered in a little rubble pile somewhere else. I, I assume in Greece, but like, so is this, is this after Leonidas? Uh, died at, at, at the it Battle of Thermopylae? Oh, wait, what day did that happen? I don't know. Anyway, shh, story. Oh, get, Jesus Christ, put some shorts on. Tell your boss he can stick it. Oi! Oh, fuck him up, Cassandra. Fuck him up! If you want to do it, I will. Here we go. Have, would you, you see this spear? Would you like to taste it? Because I feel like you're about to swallow it. Shaft and all! Fucking come here. Come here, cockbag. Oh, parry. And then fucking stab. Stab, stab, kill. Do everything. No, focus on this guy. Oh, yes! Fucking taste my blade! You're gonna have a dick once I'm finished with you. Focus on the other dude. On the other dude. The guy, oh, he's dead. Okay. I just, can we, can we teabag him? Wait, I'm a girl. Can I still teabag? I don't know. I'm gonna kill you both on top of each other so you both lick each other's nutsacks in the afterlife, motherfuckers. That's what you get for punching a girl in the schnoz when she wasn't even expecting it. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Oh, yeah? Just of course. help, help yourself. <laughs> I like that I think the same way my character does. That makes me happy. It makes the immersion just a little bit better. I was like, bitch, stop eating all my food without asking. And then Cassandra's like, oi, bitch, stop eating all my food without asking. I mean, she didn't really say it like that. She said it in her ancient Greek way of just help yourself, not the Australian. Get fucked, mate! You are kidding. You just ate all my food and now you want a tip for giving me some non even not even interesting information? You little extortionistic little fuck. How are these guys alive? Um, I'm pretty sure I just made you swallow my spear from tip to tail. You fucking what? Okay, so choices. The choices you make have impacts both seen and unseen. Consider your options carefully. Some affect the story and are permanent. Holy shit, there's like a moral gameplay mechanic? 
Ooh. Also, you get to choose conversations now. It hasn't happened in any of the Assassin's Creed before. You now get to choose. It's like like a Telltale game. Uh, R.I.P. Telltale. Uh, where you you can choose how conversations go and choose reactions apparently. But this cocksucker is going to die. You're you dead. A mistake coming here. Yeah, you fucking did. We're gonna. F I already murdered you once. I'll murder you again. Come here. Oh shit. Okay, they, they got a little bit bad. There you go. Stab you. Stab you. Oh. Oh yeah! I don't have to kill you again, you zombified motherfuckers! When I kill you once, fucking stay down! Well, here come the vultures or whatever they are. Are they ibises? It's the ibis. Banjo's drinking gronk. Okay, well, I guess it's time for me to leave my home and go out on an adventure. Do I have a, a horse? Can I? Can I has horse? Nope, that's my eagle. Okay, so I do have an eagle friend to look after me with. Um, who's this guy? Is this guy? An enemy? No, nah, just some peasant. Just some peasant cruising around. That's a little, uh, that's, a, that's a thing of interest. We'll have to go all the way over there. That's, that's a long way to go. Though. Ooh. What is that? It's like Atlantis. Okay, remember remember, remember my training from uh, from Origin. So that's that's a thing there. Gotcha. And a fucking dude on the road. Yes, more murder. So I could go and find my objective over here somewhere. But if you look at that, there's a, a bloody uh, a viewpoint all the way on top of Zeus's finger. And I don't know about you, but I want to go get fingered by Zeus. That seems like... <laughs> I regret nothing about that, how I phrased that. That is exactly what I wanted to say. I want to get up to the tippy top of this point and see what I can see, see, see. Because there's probably an ocean nearby that's bluer than the sea. That's, well, however, however that song goes. I don't know. I'm just excited to go climb shit. I fucking love Assassin's Creed. I love that they've uh, they've kept the, uh, the the climb anything mechanic from uh, from Origins. Like, if you like, climb up any sort of wall you like. I mean, like, buildings and stuff, it's you have to find the right way, but, like, cliffs and things, you can climb anything you want. Like that. Just, like, there's no little footholds or ankle holds or toe holds anywhere there. You were just climbing sheer rock because you're a fucking assassin, you badass. Oh, Ezio would be proud. I'll tell you not so much because I'll tell you couldn't climb for shit. But Ezio, that man was a gun. That man could climb a vertical wall without a toe, a toe hold anywhere. All right, there we go. Look at that. He's flying up this massive statue. This is so freaking cool. This is so freaking cool. I'm having a fucking ball. Please don't miss. Oh, you almost missed. Okay, up we go. Like how quickly it like and like aggressively she jumps up sheer faces. Like if one fall slip up here and you fall a very long way to your death, and this game would be over very quickly. But I've made it and it looks fucking awesome. And look at the view. Oh, it's so pretty. It took me all night to climb up here. Well, I didn't really. It just turned to night because I got near the quest. Oh, that's gorgeous. God, this game's gorgeous. Oh, bit of upskirt action. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Thank God you're wearing boy shorts under there because otherwise several 13-year-old fanboys might have just hit puberty right then. All right, where, where, where am I going? It's like down here, isn't it? I think this is the way I came from. I've got a little bit disorientated. Oh, that's my house over there. All the way over there on the coast. What? A, if I'm not a rich person, that's a pretty fucking good spot to be living, isn't it? Is that not like a valuable like piece of land? Because I feel like it is. Oh, shit. Oh, ankles. Sandals won't protect you from that. Hey, buddy. Time for a chat. Remember all those uh, Daenerys? Wait, what's the what's the Greek coins called? I keep telling you. you drachma. The, remember, remember that drachma you owe me? But instead you spent it on your stupid want. vineyard. How about you pay your dues first, you buddy thief and fuck? Phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Cassandra. Oh my god, this Marcos dude is such a knob jockey. After making it so difficult for me to get my money, I'm taking one of his horses because fuck him, that's why. Uh, but now, I mean, okay, let's go. Let's uh, press Y to go to quest objective. Come on. Go, go, yep, there you go. Okay, there you go, there we go. I remember how to ride a horse in this game. And now they're taking little Phoebe, the little shit who ate all my fruit and then racked some money from me, the little extortionistic little fuck. But that's all right. Maybe I can go waterboard her just to the beach a little while and get my money back. But I do have to go save a little child, so I guess I'll be the hero. Well, not for a change, but this time as well. All right, we're here. Let's go. It's stealth mode. Let's, how do I, okay, first thing on stealth is to get off the horse. How do I, okay, I'm gonna hold B. Cool. I probably could have told me that before. So now I just need to sneak in and fight. How do I duck? 
Is there, is there, there we go. Okay, gotcha. I'm figuring out how to play all over again. But it's all right, we'll get there. I will save Phoebe, and then she can come and extort me for money again later. And, you know, I'm sure once I save her life, she'll ask me for a tip for giving me the pleasure. Little bitch. It's all right, fam. I've got this. Get, get, fucking duck, you goose. I was trying to duck. Uh, B to crouch. Oh, uh, Icarus not available. Okay, well, do I can't move. So good. Okay, this is the, this is my why do I assassinate? This is my tutorial, I guess. Uh, oh, 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 buddy, that uh, that was not a good move. You got a spear through the back of your dog, and that probably hurt quite a bit. The last thing you ever thought was, holy shit, I can taste blade, and nothing has gone into my mouth. <laughs> okay, press down, down to whistle. Oh, I can lure them. Yes, four Hitman spec. I can lure them into the weeds. I forgot about that too. I've been playing all the old Assassin's Creed, so I forgot about all the... Oh, <laughs> oh death by anal penetration. Fuck, that was cool. Okay, I love I love all this Assassin's shit. I love making this shit play in my little hands. I am the puppet master. Come to me. Did you hear someone whistle? You probably did. You should probably go investigate. It's not like the other two friends you had have mysteriously disappeared and you've heard some slight gurgling from the room. <laughs> yes, Cassandra. Oh, not only are you gorgeous, you're fucking lethal as shit too. Oh, this guy. This guy, I've got ya. I've got ya. Just wait, are you even. I don't even gotta worry about you. Oh, no, I will. I'll lure you. I'll lure you into the bush. You were taking a squat over in the corner. You never take a squat when there's threats about because you're gonna die unsatisfied. Yes! I'll get over there and untie you in a second. I have to real quick just uh, raid these guys' stuff for everything they might have. Dark steel chest plate. Oh, it's level two. I can't use that. And a broken shield. Uh, anything else? Anything else more important than you, you little bitch? You better remember this the next time you ask for money from me and start eating all my food without asking me first. <sighs> all right. What's, what's your excuse this time? What's your excuse for getting kidnapped? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since since my parents died. I'm okay. I've got you and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? You have to be stronger than that. Don't get me! Let him have it! <laughs> Again, up. Yes, father. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready or stop? Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Good. Good. Uh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight we are having baby Alexios. <laughs> and what a feast he will be. No, not him. Take me instead. I'm tasty. Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Here. Lay him in his bed. Yes, pater. Cassandra. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Oh man. As soon as a, uh, an NPC tells you that he's proud of you or that he's always, he's always gonna love you or some sort of mushy like lovey dovey shit, that means they're immediately about to die. But we got some backstory on Cassandra. She is a Spartan and the Spartan kids were trained, well at least the boys were always trained to be soldiers because the Spartan way of life was to be a soldier. I don't 
think the women were, but I'll give Assassin's Creed the benefit of the doubt because traditionally they have always been right on the money with all their historical facts. So I'm going to assume that I was wrong about that and that they probably did train the girls as well. You oh, we're still expositioning. Oh, this is cool. This is all the mercenaries in the game. This is like Shadow of Mordor level stuff. Look at this. Oh, there's nine tiers of dudes, five in each tier. One, or one in tier one, three in tier two, and five in all the tiers after that. That is some awesome shit. Fuck, that's cool. This game is wicked already. I love what they have done with it. This makes me a happy boy. Keep pressing RT to run. That is not the button to run. A fight would tell us why I have to go murder the first mercenary. Oh, do I have time? I don't I don't have time. I'm gonna have to do that in the next episode because I've run out. That's a lot of exposition to have. I mean, look, it's the first kind of like hour of gameplay that I've walked you through. But that's so cool. That is just so cool. And the game is so gorgeous. It's so pretty. I'm having a fucking blast. And I've only just got into this. I can call my horse with down. I just did, but the horse... So how does the horse know? Because that's the same button to lure the guys into the brush. So, like, what's going to happen when I'm hiding in the weeds one day? I was hiding in the weeds one day. And then the horse is just going to come up and start licking the back of my head, which might draw a little bit of attention to me. Speaking of which, well, I'm going to have to worry about it, because apparently the horse doesn't fucking show up when I call him. So, whatever. That is Assassin's Creed Odyssey, the first little part of it. Anyway, hey, horsey, how you doing? How you doing, buddy? I am going to come back and play a whole lot of this on the channel, so brace yourselves for that, but I just love that there is a female assassin. Look, look, I mean, look, she's gorgeous. Cassandra is hot as fuck, but just having a feminine hero is so cool, especially when you consider assassins stealthy and like uh, i mean if you play any sort of rpg game uh, a, a stealthy assassin or like a um a, a stealth type character is usually a girl smaller silhouette lighter movements all that kind of stuff so i'll have to continue cassandra's career as a spartan in ancient greece in the next episode with the hero shot to boot in the next episode because this episode is done so thank you guys for watching most of all thank you to all the patrons on patreon who made this episode possible if you like to make the like button down below and subscribe to this channel follow me on twitter but i don't talk to you there first i'll see you in the next episode have a good one